Do you have your phone on you? Okay. Oh, you have your phone, James. What does it kill? Uh, Club Bowl Sonic Charities. Facebook or Instagram? Facebook. Hey, Facebook. How's it look? 4K? Hey, uh, Club Bowl Yeah, good. Uh, it's okay. Okay, here goes Wayne Farinacci for his first point of the match. Looks to be a good first roll. Game is to 12 in this championship match. Here comes Mike, a waterside local. For his first point, uses the wall to come off and touches the Pauline. Here comes Frank DeSillo to shoot. Hit! And a nice Paulino shot. Let's try to get this angle if you can. You see right there. So Frank with a nice hit. Here goes Lou for his shot. And here's our referee of the day, Dante from the Botch Bros. We refereeing this championship match. <laughs> But we right now currently have Club Molsani Charities versus Troy ICC in this Waterside 2v2 Ambassador Cup Championship match. Lou is shooting again. His own ball clips it. So he brings him in. Rocks the Paulina a little bit. But brings it in. But we'll see. Dante's going to try to point or see, measure this. So Lou and Mike today have the blue, green, and white balls as Frank and Wayne will be rolling with their white, green, and white balls. So now Lou is down the court talking with Mike. Lou in the red, Mike in the gray, Frank in the black, and Wayne in the white. Troy ICC from the New York area, while Club Molsani Charities in just outside Cleveland, Ohio, in Wycliffe, Ohio. And as you saw there, Mike rolled to the back wall and it touched the back wall. The back wall is dead here with, with open rules, but your ball must touch a nut, something before hitting the back wall, just like that. One. I don't know, Frank. Bumps it in, just one. But if your ball touches the back wall and touches nothing, the ball is burned. So here comes Frank DeSillo rolling in for two. Currently have one. And just missed. So one for Frank and Wayne to start this championship match. As you see, Dante heads down the court. Game is to 12. Frank and Wayne will be green and Mike and Lou will be red. And if uh, you guys are kind of wondering where we're at, we're at Waterside in Phoenix, New York. Bocce and Cigar Club. They have two synthetic courts. They were both designed and created by the Colioni court makers. Courts are very beautiful. We were rolling on them all weekend long. Very true the way they roll. A slight curve off the wall as you see Wayne's first point using the wall. Nice little hand slap there.
Who fired? And he hits. <laughs> so Lou would have hit, but the break does not go his way. You see, the plane is near the back wall. It was Mike again. Mike rolls. We're using the wall. But Dante wagging the finger saying it will be short and no good. So, three balls used. Lou using his fourth. He'll roll his in. Good roll off the wall. It's got the distance. And it touches the back wall. So four balls used. Going early off the wall. He's going to be well short. An opportunity here to get a big inning. And Wayne's second ball is short, so Frank will try his first ball. Comes off the wall. And a great roll by Frank. Stays in and everything. Frank will go again. There he goes, going past mid-court. It's going to be tough to see. He's got the line. And a nice roll by Frank right there to capitalize for three points. As they push their lead four to nothing to start this championship match. It is a single, just one game championship match as we did a pool play all, all weekend long, all day Saturday. We, everyone, there was uh, three groups, played five games in the group play, and then everyone advanced to Sunday as there was a single elimination bracket, and you are down from 18 teams down to, to two of the final teams. Wayne's first point looks to be way long. Not happy about that one. Here goes Mike now, using the wall also. Bangs the wall, will be short, but it looks to be the point. Dante giving the signal, he's going in to double check. The quick measure, over three. So Wayne, with the room, is gonna point. Oh, it came off the wall. Too much of a curve there, lays behind Mike's ball. So Wayne's first two balls out. Here comes Frank now, looking to establish a point. And a nice point there. You're looking at two feet. You want it, Zach? No, go Comes Mike now for his point. So a nice roll by Mike hits it in. It's going to force Frank now to try to roll in. He clips the wall. A little hot on the poly and he gets it. Pushes it in for two. So a great roll by Frank there. And here comes. Lou now, two balls, let's see how he does here with the shot, he fires, oh, 
clipped his ball in the front. <laughs> Gonna go, go for it again. Oh. Blue fires. Hits the Pauline to the back wall. It's racing around. And look at that. There's two, three, three points for Lou with that shot. There he is now. Hitting the Pauline. Racking around the back wall to get three in that frame. To now cut the deficit down to one. It's four to three. The sirens do something for me. <laughs> <laughs> Great shot by Lou. Pardon. Nice shot, buddy. Hey. Did Tony Fatica come over here? <laughs> oh, yeah. the guy that makes the sirens. So a great last frame. Frank rolling in, touching the Pauline to push it in for two. Lou lining up his final ball to hit the Pauline down the court. Racking around the Pauline in the back wall was ended up with three. I like the spot. I like that spot. Off the wall. Come on. Go right there. There goes Wayne. I like it. I like it. There you go. Good ball. Good roll by Wayne there. Here comes Lou lining this up. Fires. Bang! Gets it out. <laughs> Clipped it. Ball. <coughs> Wayne again rolling, putting it back. Nice ball. Wow. <coughs> Good spot, too. Shot. <coughs> Boom. What a nice hit by Lou. He's heating up in, in this game now. Three hits in a row. Frank now rolling. <coughs> Could be a little hot. Dante says no. So Frank rolling in his final ball. Right next to Pauline, Lou and Mike are going to discuss what they want to do next. <laughs> Lou with a little message. <laughs> Fires. Well, look at that roll by Mike there. He just touched the Pauline. Looks like he's got it. And a great roll by Mike. He elected to point instead of shooting that out, and as you saw, went off the wall and right on top of that Pauline. It's a little tap, but he's in for the point. So we're knotted at four to four here, here in Waterside Club in Phoenix, New York. So Mike puts the Pauline deep near the wall. Here comes his first point. Looks to be hot. Oh, but touched the Pauline a little past. Hitting that Pauline slowed him down a little bit. Now here comes Wayne looking to steal the point. 
Rolling straight right at it, and it's going to be short. Corta. So, Frank shooting. Nice hit by Frank. He's able to get it out. You see the two balls here. So they're far to the left. Wayne's ball in front. Let's see. Lou wants to know the measurement. Three feet. Comes Mike's. It looks to be short. If his ball is short, Wayne is still holding the point. So Lou now will step up and point. So here comes Lou from the Troy ICC Club. A nice roll off the wall. And let's Dante make the call. He's looking at it. He's pulling at it, and it's going to be in. He's going to double check. Remember to measure twice, shoot once. So a good measurement there by Dante. Measure twice, botch once. And Wayne now will point in. A straight line. Is it enough? Time to get the signal. It's in. So Wayne gets in there. Lou and Frank with a ball each in the back. Tie score, 4-4. Four to four. This championship match at Waterside. Here comes Lou's point. Going the same approach. Is he going to have enough? It will not. It will be short. So Wayne and Frank have... So Frank lining up a shot. Fires. Oh. Missed it. But just one for Frank and Wayne. They get the Pauline back. Yeah. <laughs> Five four, Frank and Wayne. I know. Jeez, old man, got all Wayne using the bocce scooper to pick up his balls today. And there goes his first point. He's going to use the wall. Touch about mid-court. A little long. So Mike is going to step up and try to steal it. Mike used the wall well short of the point. So he'll go again. Mike uses the wall. Is it in? Dante looking, looking, looking. And confirms. Mike gets the point. I see it, I see it. I can I am afraid to go to that point. I don't know if it's a man. Wayne looking to steal it. Taking a straight line approach. Good ball. And a great ball by Wayne right there to take it back. So Lou now will step up. Steal it. 
a little bit hot. Falling to the right. Falling to the right. And we'll get go past Wayne's ball. Blue fires? No. And a miss left. Hey, wait. Take one shot, Pauline. You can. I mean, the pack ball's got it. <clears throat> Even if it, one shot. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> Frank shoots Pauline and misses. Yeah, we'll see it, Mike. <clears throat> so he'll decide to roll in after that missed shot to the Pauline. He's going to roll in and see if he can get two out of it. And Frank's got two fingers up. He thinks it's in. Dante measuring. Two it is. So Frank, even with a missed shot, he'll capitalize on his second ball to roll in. To give him two points as they push their lead seven to four. And there's our today's referee for today's championship match. Dante, you want to say anything? Uh, yeah, FoxPros.com, <laughs> Instagram, Facebook, and Luciano's one of the best announcers in the game. Oh, well, thank you, Dante. So a little plug in there by Dante, today's referee, as we get back to this match. Let's go down to the court. <laughs> as the Bocce Bros were down here this weekend also battling. And Wayne's first point, a little long, but a nice ball. Oh, that's it. <laughs> Where comes Mike's point now? He's going to roll on it so he can steal it. What's your handle? He uses the wall. And he will get it. A nice roll by Mike right there using the wall just in front of the Pauline. We'll put Frank in a shooting position. And a big hit by Frank, but the Pauline squirts the back wall. His ball does not go with it. So you see uh, Mike's ball went down as Wayne and Frank's kind of stayed around. So let's see what Frank tries to do. He's lining up his own ball. He fires, hits it. Oh! Gets the point. So Frank hitting his ball, trying to bring that ball down, was able to, and it gets the point, but it's a wide margin, as you see the Pauline is over here, and the next point is all the way out there. The first point, I should say. Trying my best to keep this camera steady. Just have it on a little tripod that I'm holding. So we'll try to get the best angles we can here at the Waterside Club in Phoenix, New York. Mike, going in for the point. Looks a bit hot. And it will be. So Mike burned his ball on his second one. So now Lou's going to have to go. So 7-4, Frank and Wayne. Here comes Lou for his point. Just got to keep it in play. There it is. Good ball by Lou. Deep near the back wall. Two feet, Frank saying it is. So Wayne now has got a point. This is his last ball. It's a little bit hot. Uh-oh. Not the back wall. <clears throat> Too much on it. So his ball will be burned. Lou's point is in. He's got one more to roll. Pretty wide margin to get the point. Let's see if he does it. Chance to get two here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
just one. He's not able to get it. So that point doesn't beat that one over there. So only one for Lou and Mike. That's the score now is seven to five. But they get the Pauline back. It's in their possession. As Mike will first point and start the frame. So the Pauline is I like it, Mike. I like it. past <coughs> mid-court, rolls a nice first ball, sets Frank up to shoot, fires, he gets it out, nice hit by Frank. Straight line approach looks to be a bit hot, but it gets to Pauline. Nice. It's a little long, <coughs> two feet long. Don't even run the walk, this is a little point. I just want. So Wayne rolling in. Good ball. Oh, yeah, nice ball. Look at that ball there. What a roll by Wayne using the wall and is now right next to Pauline. Lou fires. Misses right. So he's going to elect a point here. So Lou putting the ball in front is short. Frank and Wayne have the point. I'll try to zoom in here to show you guys. Now it gets a little fuzzy. Try to focus in. Wayne is rolling his ball now. Let's see how this comes in. You see that come this ball? Will it have enough? Oh, and only one. Only one. You didn't get the one in the front or the back? So he didn't beat the back one, but get past that front ball. And Frank rolls. He doesn't like it. Did he tap in? Oh. And they're looking at it. It looks to be only one. And it is. So Wayne and Frank not able to capitalize to try to get a two or three points out of that frame. So now we are eight to five, Wayne and Frank, in this championship match at the Waterside Ambassadors Cup. The games are to 12, as we did pool play all weekend long, into a single elimination bracket on Sunday. And 18 teams started the weekend, and now down to the final two. Wayne, good ball to start the frame. Here comes Mike for his first point. And it comes off. Oh, it's going to bump into Wayne's. So no good on the point. Bumps him up just a little bit. That's why it's important to stay in front. Mike going again. Same line approach will come in and gets around. What a point by Mike. Great roll right there to get right in front of the Pauline. A nice fundamental point right there to show you folks. Okay. Frank shoots. Bang! He hits it. What a nice shot there. Pauline right into the back wall. But his ball not able to go down. 
As you and Mike have the point. I like to hear it. It opens. <clears throat> so Frank was able to hit that, but not establish the point. So Wayne now will go the distance. <clears throat> not going to be enough on these 64 foot courts here at Waterside. Frank coming in, look at this roll and woo! Great roll by Frank there, going the full 64 feet. Now Lou's got two balls, He's shooting. Oh, what a hit by Lou. Great shot. <laughs> so Lou, now with one point, looking to capitalize on his hit. And he will. You see his ball there, Paulina there. It's two for Lou and Mike. As they try to climb back into this, and it's an eight to seven score. Here goes Mike for his first point in the frame. I like it, Mike. I like it. Deep. And a nice ball. <laughs> Shoots! And a Pauline hit by Frank, but oh, it hits the back wall and came back up. He opens it up, but... He was hoping that Pauline would have stayed back there. Wayne now rolling, going left wall. And a good roll by Wayne to get the point. Goes Mike now pointing in. It's the wall. Is it going to be enough? It looks to be short. So Lou now using his first ball. Here comes Lou, just going straight at it. He's going to touch his ball. It clips his ball. Oof, had the speed and the really was gonna make it in a nice roll, but he clipped his ball and split. So he's in front but short. Wayne has the has the point. So Lou. One more ball. Looking to figure out what he can do here on his final ball. <clears throat> Just try to focus this in a little bit. <clears throat> Blue going straight at it again, rolling in. <clears throat> Bombs it. Oh. Let's see. Actually, that might be the point. One. 
just one. So Luke is able to get the job done, rolled in and clipped his ball, but was able to sneak in for the point. So Pauline, Frank over the Pauline shot. Gets the Pauline. Does what he said he would do. But oh, off the back wall and came back in. So Frank is just hitting this ball way too hard. <laughs> These balls are coming off the back wall as Pauline. But he was on target though. Was hoping to keep the Pauline in the back wall. But ricocheted too hard off. So now Wayne. Firing. Oh. Wayne looking to go at the wall, the wall shot, try to push the Pauline down the court and just missed it. So Lou and Mike get one on the frame. We are tied here, eight to eight, here at Waterside Club. Games to 12. As we get closer to the mark in these final few frames. I just want to thank uh, Gabe and Dino for the great weekend they put on for us. For all these teams coming down here, getting together, having bocce discussions. All right, Mike's first roll long. So Wayne will go. Comes Wayne's first point. Look at that roll. And a great roll by Wayne. Puts Lou. Gets him ready to shoot. Fires. Oh. And misses. All right, so Wayne's point still in a good ball has Mike rolling in now. Trying to potentially roll on this, but it looks like it won't make it. <laughs> Here comes Lou now. Using his first ball. It's a good ball. Not the point, but just trying to protect now. As he threw his last ball. So Frank and Wayne coming down the court now to check it out and see the situation. Lou putting a good ball in front to try to cover up. His first ball was a missed shot, but his first rolling by the frame puts it nicely in the position of where now Frank and Wayne got to try to figure out what they want to do. They have three balls, Wayne one, Frank with two. So they're, let's see what they do here with three balls on the back. Imagine Frank's going to shoot to try to open up this thing, and he will. He fires. Oh, hit that front one. Okay, he's going to shoot again. He fires. Oh, he misses the left. So Frank shot and missed, was trying to open it up for Wayne. See how he does here, it's going to be a tight point. 
He's going wall. He looks to. It's going to come off too far. So just one for Frank and Wayne as they retain the lead 9 to 8 here at Waterside Club in this championship match. All right, Wayne's going to start the frame. Ball, Pauline pass midcourt. He's going to roll his ball on the left side of the wall. And a great first ball by Wayne to start the frame. Lou shoots. And just missed right. So Lou's first ball is burned. Fires. He flipped it. He's able to get it out. But a lot of room for Wayne to point in. Looking to put that ball back. So same approach. To, hits the wall mid-court, which would be a bit short. I love the point. There goes Mike. And short. Is it going to be in? Is that it? Yeah. And it's in. So Frank, why am shot? Fires. Nice hit by Frank to get it out. Frank fires. He hits it. Is it enough? It is. And that's it. Frank with the final hit. A good shot there. Hits the ball out. Mike's point for three points to win 12 to 8. Frank and Wayne winning the 2022 Waterside Ambassadors Cup Championship. A nice match by both teams. Great pointing and shooting overall. We'll go down court side. Frank and Wayne from Club Molsani winning. How you feeling, Wayne? I'm feeling great. We hit 41. <laughs> you know, Frankie sits around every time he hits. He did it again. Did it again. Hey, thank you for uh, Waterside for sponsoring this uh, great tournament. 77 years to play. Excellent. Excellent courts. Uh, unbelievable. These yeah. people are unbelievable here. They came out. They came out very well. And fabulous. Yeah. Uh, fabulous. Yeah. What they laid out here. Uh, the whole weekend. Yeah, those were fantastic. Yeah. Beautiful tournament. They overdid themselves yes, yes. in generosity. Just we definitely recommend coming here and playing these courts. They're beautiful courts as well. Awesome. Thank you again. Thank you. <laughs> no problem. Thank you for having us. <laughs> Good stuff, Frank. So as you guys can see, here is the facility. Here's the first court. You see here, looking around. A little bar in the corner here. 
No problem. So you guys see here the courts. Got some nice logos here down the rails. Nice logo here. And I'll show you guys quickly their cigar room. It's pretty nice. Okay, so let's go through here. Oh. Great game. As you guys see here, their cigar room. Got a bar here. All ventilated. Hey, well done, both sides. Well done. Some nice chairs. Some nice lockers here. So that is our cigar room in this facility. The two bocce courts. See these little statues? <laughs> You can see they have a nice uh, window here from the cigar room. You can see the courts. And when you come out this door, you're on the other side now. Here's the courts again. Just a quick view. Nice plexiglass windows. And we'll look at the bracket real quick. I'll show you guys what the bracket looked like through the weekend. We come over here. Here is the bracket, single elimination bracket. Want to pencil in Molsani there, James? James Savaggio. Spell, Luch. Oh, this is just a big year. All right. Got it. All right, yeah, James. Nice. <laughs> Did an awesome job. Very nice handwriting. Oh, yeah. This is supposed to be number tall. So there's the bracket. So we had three Molsani teams this weekend competing. There's some nice photos, too. These are washable, right? Here is the banner they this weekend with all the logos. Chris Gabe, how you doing, Gabe? How's it going? Thank you for having us. As you see, here is a banner. It's a little bit. Uh, all the, uh, it, was, it, was, it was health. We got it behind the backboard. Luch, tell them how great the Water Strike Club is. Oh, amazing. What are your thoughts, Lou? I mean, again, two great guys. Great ambassadors. Yeah, let's pick him. That's all Thank you. Thank you. Great Mike here. Great Mike here. Mike here. Mike here. Mike here. Mike here. Hey, did you get the cannolis? In the picture? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Thanks for the opportunity. How do we go back? Uh, Take yeah, I'm ready. You're trying to help him out here, but I don't think I'm doing it. Go ahead your partner. Are there 18 teams? I mean, like 18. Yeah, Why don't you set it on the windowsill and then take it to your partner? We need a picture of all six of us, too. Oh, yeah. All six of us? A little lower there, Dan. Oh, 
Dwayne? No. That's her reward. Just all I get. Hey, Billy, Billy. Wait, yeah. Come on in, we'll do it. Hey, Frank. Yeah. Yeah. Speech, Frank. Speech. Speech. I already yeah. <coughs> we got live stream over here. Wait, come on in. Where's Frank? Right. Come on, come on. You guys get it, right? Uh, it's okay. Yeah, good name. Yeah. yeah. It's Frank and Wayne doing their medals. They also won a bocce set. Hey, Joe. Each of them. This, this, this means a lot going to Wayne. Wayne's been a fantastic mentor here for us at the Waterside. You got my other opponent. Fantastic ambassador of the game up here in upstate and whatnot. So, for us here out of here. So, where's, where's the name? Congratulations. Both of them did a, each a bocce set. And show them, Frank, what color you got. Blue ball. Pull one out. Blue Thank you, everybody, for watching from Waterside Club in. You the chairs. Grab all the chairs in the cigar room. We need those for the cigar room. So that's uh, going to conclude the tournament of the weekend. Thank you, Waterside Club from Phoenix, New York. Thank you guys for tuning in and watching. Frank and Wayne from Club Molsani Charities winning the tournament. As we. Uh, conclude the tournament the weekend phenomenal time thank you everyone see you guys soon ciao